Hey there. Let's see what people are saying about climate change on the good old internet. Always in charge. Oh, it is it a liberal deal. hoax to take my truck away. Cool. Hi, I'm Raleigh Williams, climate science grad student, and the guy who's got to get that laptop after this. God damn it. A lot of people have been lied to about climate change, and it's hard to tell what's real. But if you give me two minutes of your time, I can give you some extremely fact-checkable evidence that might help convince you that climate change is happening. Welcome to Climate Town. Okay, number one, every oil, coal, and gas company has admitted that climate change is real and humans are causing it. All of them. All of them. Now they have super good lawyers, so they probably won't face any consequences for their actions, but after years of loudly denying climate change, they have finally all quietly accepted the blame. And you don't have to take my word for this. Just Google climate change and in the name of any oil company and go buck wild on their corporate website. Here are the climate change is real sections of BP. Exxon. Just wait. Goose in the shot? Yep. <laughs> hey man, can you, can you grab that laptop? Number two, all of America's insurance companies and economist groups agree that climate change is slowly taking a baseball bat to the balls of the American economy. All of them. Conservative, liberal, young, old, Dracula. They're not being paid off by big climate, cause that's not a thing. And just to be clear, this is not theoretical. Actual insurance companies are paying billions of dollars because there are more fires and floods and droughts and storms and heat waves. I mean, there's always gonna be a thousand bing bongs on Twitter talking shit about climate change, but the people whose actual job it is to predict risk are saying climate change is just number one. And number three, Every scientific community in every country in the world agrees that climate change is dangerous and we have a limited amount of time to stop it. All of them. These are not political, they're not partisan, they're just scientists in their science labs doing science sh**. They're pouring beakers into smaller beakers, they're looking at air, and they're using computers. They are not in cahoots. In fact, they're actively trying to prove each other wrong because that's how you get to the top of the science community. Punch the light! Think about it. There are literal trillions of dollars in funding waiting for the first scientist who can prove climate change is a hoax. Don't you think it's a little weird that no one has come forward with the evidence? What are you doing? Hey, hey, I'm talking to you. Did you poop here? Oh, okay, mature. Real mature. Fucking goose. So yes, a few extra carbon dioxide molecules in the atmosphere cooking a planet seems counterintuitive, but so does using electrified liquid crystals on a supercomputer the size of an Eggo waffle to watch a guy talk about climate change, yet here we are. We ask science to figure out things for us all the time, and they've figured out climate change so hard that even the companies with a financial interest in denying it have gotten on board. It's good to be skeptical, and it's stupid to blindly follow authority. But it's not exactly smart to get all your information from memes and some guy on Facebook. So just ask yourself this. What's more likely? That a shadowy cabal of all the climate scientists, economists, oil companies and insurance firms in the world are involved in a 100 year conspiracy that's only ever been found out by an intrepid handful of uncles with a tenuous grasp on Photoshop, or that email you just got that was the subject line forward, 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 re, forward, forward, you gotta see this climate change hoax might not have been completely trustworthy. And that's it. Was that two minutes? Uh, three minutes. Oh, way over. Okay, sorry. Um, thank you for watching if you got this far. If you want to send this to somebody who might be a skeptic, I think that would be good. Obviously, I'm not going to convince everybody, but if I can get six people to do a little Googling, that's probably worth it. Okay, I got to get that laptop. I could just leave it. No, I can't. This is a climate thing. That'd be okay. Okay. Ah. I lost. There we go. There it is. <sighs> is this comedy? Is any of this funny? Was it worth it? Maybe. We'll see. Thanks for watching. Oh, God.